Welcome back to Favorites with Laura. So today, I haven't done a big haul in a while. I've done a couple little things. I've done some recording, but they haven't gone up because I didn't like how they came out. So, so stay tuned to the end because I promised in the past one to do a comparison between the lip mask of Timu and the name brand one. So I do have that. Um, it was going to be a separate recording and I thought I should just tack it on here because I know um, I promised that and I think it's going to be some good information for you to see. So with that said, we're going to jump right into the haul that I have here. Now there's one, whoops, there's one, two, and then it's about 36 items and I spent like $39 on it. So that's over here. Okay, so sounds like a lot maybe but let me tell you this is a free item here that I won maybe from viewing and um, could be slightly due to a few purchases um, if, if you know you what I mean you know um, but it let me pick a free gift I think it was in my cart too at one time and out of my cart I do that a lot because we all know I don't have a wish list and I'm not gonna talk about that have you seen my new background I bought some accessories for them. My friend and I went out and we were able to get a few things. So you know how I always have trouble seeing? I think this might be my thumbnail. Oh my gosh, you guys. Yes, this might be it. These are metal, but I thought she saw these and she's like, oh my gosh, you have to have those. So I can see it in the picture. This, because I always end up with hearts and I love this is a one, two, three, four, five, five little um, tote thing here. And so what I've done is I'm putting things in here that I can change out my display with. So this is all from between TJ Maxx at the Home Goods store, which I think they're all um, under the same umbrella of ownership. So a lot of things, if you can't find it at TJ Maxx, they will have at Home Goods. Now, Home Goods will be probably a, a dollar more or so at that location, but if you can't find it at TJ Maxx, then that's where it is. And I just love that all these stores are stocking back up. But anyway, I digress. This is a Timu haul, so let's get started. So let's open up the, the free item that I was able to select from one of my orders. You guys, I don't know. This is um, getting a little crazy now, but again, I succumbed to the pressures of feeling left out and I saw other people hauling this and like the whole reason it was in and out of my cart so many times now look at this is so funny it's so so collapsed um, I decided well it's free I'm gonna give it a shot it's ridiculous that I couldn't keep track of that now this is one of those fans I liked it because it collapses small and it snaps out let's see here this was the free item but does it stay snapped out i don't know look at that it keeps collapsing of course there's a cord in there because i don't have enough cords that would probably fit this by now um but i do like the the collapse okay so it doesn't lock into place so it's going to be a little bit more flexible and if and of course because I got it for free I'm still going to try to find the link for you so that we can um, share this for you uh, well oh okay so there's the the charger part port wow I kind of like that because this room does get a little warm okay a lot of editing in this one I told myself I was going to try to do one that a video all the way through I'm not edit but you know it's gonna get too long <laughs> I only have so much battery life in my phone or my my camera here so yeah okay so this next item I already took one thing out was playing around with it because I don't have a lot of palettes so I found this oh by the way thank you for coming back to my channel everything as always is in my description box below and then you're gonna see a little screenshot or side by side um, I haven't decided because I change it up all the time or you're gonna and you're definitely gonna see the price at the time of making the video um, and if it's sold out or not available or discontinued I also mentioned that either below or not or up on the screen or verbally here if I know already and then also if 
it is in that situation where it's sold out or not available I can't provide a link they don't give me a link to do that and um, but I will make a comment below okay so moving forward a palette of uh, there we go that looks like it's in focus I hope um, pink sand wonderland 24 colors eyeshadow palette now I like pinks and neutrals and then I'm trying to expand my horizons with a little bit more option but I just thought this was beautiful and I just loved the color palette that it provides because I need a lot of light colors to brighten up and open up my eye and as well as some you know little sparkle here so Man, this is going to be a long video. Stay tuned. Um, I am experimenting with different nail tips uh, as well as, you know, I like to do my own and things like that. So I did get these from Timu. And uh, let's see if I can block that light a little bit. Yeah, that seems to work when I do that. So I bought these two press-on nails here I want to try. And I opened up one. So those two, let me, let me just, you'll see the pictures up here, but they look just like the, the item online when I looked it up. I bought this one too because I really like the blue look. And I get them kind of shorter, but I still will probably, um, I do kind of file them down a little shorter than um, they come, even though I do buy the short ones. And in this box, um, you don't get any glue, but these work great for a temporary. And then if you want more permanent to last a little longer than a week, then you would use the glue. And it comes with a little file, so that's good. Um, they're super affordable, especially if you're looking for a temporary fix or a quick fix. They want to have their nails look nice for a special occasion. They don't have time to run and do an hour uh, mani or whatever. So, or themselves, I do them all myself. I don't, I can't sit still for that. But I have before and they've been, it's been a, a, a treat to have your nails done by someone else. But I just, I just can't. If you guys... If you guys find that difficult too, let me know in the comments because I just can't. One is for, well, I'm going to use probably both in the um, trailer, the camper when we go camping. But my friend had hauled these and I thought it was super cool. And it's a little basket. Let me take one out of here. And I think they come in gray too. You'll see that in the links below. So, I thought it was cute because when you're camping, and sometimes you have things that roll around, you know, when you're getting to your campsite or um, in your trailer or motorhome or whatever you use, um, even in your regular showers at home, this is a great little caddy to put all your shower items in, and then you can sit it into the shower or uh, tub stall of that travel trailer or motorhome and so it keeps it all there and you're not taking up cabinet space for it so I thought that was really cute I could have used this when I was in the military years and years ago um, because we all had like dorm living in the barracks and you'd have to carry all your stuff to the showers down the hall um, which was fun and go from there so this would have been a great tool to have back in those days now, before I show these next items, I um, wanted to tell you how Again. grateful I am for growing our channel here. And I would have mentioned in the past that I was going to do a giveaway at 1K subscribers, but I think I'm going to do that at now. So I'm going to put up my next video, not here, but you're going to see um, everything I'm going to include in that giveaway and the rules and how to... Um, and, um, Put your name in the hat to be drawn for that giveaway so I came across a couple of these items and I have different colors but this is really cute okay this you may have seen and I had to get so I have some that are gonna be gifts definitely one I'm not sure which color is going to go in the giveaway um, this is a oh it says by Mark Jacobs watch I just took it out of the bag and I'm hoping that I can get this a into gold tone see-through watch. So you can see through all these pieces here. And I will put the picture up. Now, the strap feels more um, like a pleather on the back side of it. And the front is a more of a shiny um, pleather, um, plastic maybe. But it has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven um, adjustable 
holes there so that you can put it on. Now, the funny thing about these, now I know you're getting what you pay for, right? So if it keeps decent time, I think it's going to be a beautiful piece to just wear whenever you, um, the smartwatch isn't like, you know, as pretty as you want to have with your outfit for that day. But it has silver hardware here and the rose gold here. So I don't know if they're all going to be like that. I have others in this box, so I'm going to show them all, of course, today. And I'm going to put this back in here because, again, I'm not sure which color is going to go into the giveaway. But one of, one of you lucky people to this channel are going to get one of these watches. So I thought those were the rest of the be Christmas Christmas stocking or Christmas gifts. And then this is a little squish, squishy, squishy piggy. And they were sold out for a while, but how cute is that? And it's pinky. <laughs> so that's probably gonna go to a gift for a youngster that I know. And I just thought, stinking, stinking cute. And it's like he's wearing a strawberry outfit here. So it's like shaped like a strawberry with the little leaves there. Super cute. Um, they say it's about, oh, I should get, you know what? I have a Timu uh, measuring tape. I'm back. And for some reason I decided to grab a cookie on the way. I forgot. <laughs> anyway, let's measure this. And so here, <laughs> the very tippy of their feet to the very bottom. So that is eight inches about well, they might even get away with saying nine. It might be eight and a half, depending on how they hold their measuring tape. Anyway, still cute. Love it. Um, it's not gonna. It's not gonna stay there. In fact, let me, put that back. let me take a sip of water. So here's this one again. So this is 36 items I purchased. Some are, you know duplicates or I bought multiple colors because I'm doing something for a friend and I wanted one set for myself. Um, 36 items for $39. Okay. So I was trying to make it sound really like a good thing when I was telling my husband, hey, I got 36 items. He's like, oh, yay, <laughs> more items. But I am going to cut back in August I think because I have lots of other ideas and things but I am gonna do hauls don't worry about that oh okay so these first couple okay so different options I'm probably gonna give two giveaways I I don't know I have giveaways in my mind and that's what's going on lately so we're gonna see a couple different things so of course this bag has everything all scattered throughout and I'm, I know I have multiple things, so I want to get those out so that you see the, the differences. I probably should have opened this up before, but I didn't. I just cut it open during one of my video moments that didn't work out. And so here we are again. Okay. Oh, okay. So that's good. So we're going to talk about that in a second. That's a little mangled, but I'm sure it'll flatten out. Hang with me, everybody. Hang. Okay. So here's the other Marc Jacobs watch and this pink is super pretty it's a little bit more vibrant it's not the fuchsia pink and it's not the pale pink so it's a little bit like almost true pink you know they have all these pink variations but look at that that is pretty too okay and we're, we're not even going to be able to see it okay so uh there we go maybe that maybe i just turn it that way a little bit you can see the pink so it's not real pale um let's see um think of this pepto bismol but it's a little prettier than that color. So I'll put the picture up next to me. So isn't that pretty? Oh my goodness. And it, it does shine. It's super pretty, you guys. Okay, so I did get Can you see that? Super pretty. They're all so pretty, and they all come bubble wrapped, so they're protected. That is a good, good, good thing. Oh, look at I got another um another palette, eyeshadow palette. Palette. So let's see which ones this is. So we're really gonna experiment with some eye makeup displays with this. So it has like a little lace holder there, so that you can see. It's a really pretty um, display box for it. The string there so you just pull that off 
and let's take a look. So these have highlighters in it too, and they did not break. I'd see, oh, oh, look at that. I just touched it. So I'll be keeping this one for sure. Um, oh yeah, so that's like a moist, some kind of moisture um, bead in there. Um, so let's do that. Yeah, with the mirror and super pretty. This is a texture up here of the image. And just they put a really nice display together. And funny thing happened. I, I should have just opened this up so you could see it all. I'm just a mess because I was trying. Eyeshadow sticks. Yes. And so what I was really interested, so I think Twisted, I always want to call her Twisted Sister. That's funny. <laughs> Twisted Gypsy, I believe is where I got the idea about these. And I was really interested in the white one because I wanted to, you know, use that for the inside of your eyes. And so I bought, I got the white one here, hopefully. This is going to work here for you. I'm holding it too close, probably. And then I got this pink as well as a darker brown. So, yeah. I'll take you see those? Don't worry, you will because I'll have them up there. And I think because I have this. Um, diamond painting. I'm I'm still like debating if I'm going to do one or give one away. I got a really good deal on one and I've never done it so I might be just doing one. But this I think is supposed to have so it's this. Let me just start showing you what it is first. I think it's supposed to so it has a cap here. We'll just take that off. Oh yeah so it has a light because I can't see anything to save my life. Oh, and it has a stick of, of wax in there because my understanding is you take that and the wax, I don't know how you get the wax to come down. Oh, so you just, oh, that, well, that's how you refill it. Okay, so I just took the whole thing apart, didn't want to. Oh my goodness, you guys, I'm a mess here. Okay, so let's get that back on. Okay, that's on. Hmm. Turn the light on. I'm gonna have to look up. Somebody knows how this operates. Anyway, that's what this is for, diamond painting. Moving on. Um, there's definitely a theme to this part of the haul, and that is, must be watches. So it has the same kind of straps on these. So I grabbed two, and one will go in my giveaway. Maybe not the same giveaway that I'm doing, but they will go in a giveaway. And they are the mouse looking like character shape cutout of the face of the watch. And I got a black and a white one. Those are so cute. And it looks like the hands do light up at night, so they have the glow part on there. Yeah, those are really pretty, you guys. They're, these are really, really pretty. This, the faces and all the hardware are silver. Silver tone. Not silver, silver, but silver tone. Maybe if I take one out. Because we can always put it back in. It's a big watch face. Isn't that pretty? And it is clear see-through. So it's just the cutout. And then it has a clear panel on the back. Looks like... Yeah. There might be a coating on there. That's cute. And again... Super affordable. Um, I do have my out of focus again. Okay, these are super cute. They're gold tone. Now I have a lot of silver, so I thought, why not? And they're they're very cute. They look more white on here. I guess I'm gonna have to turn down some lighting or something because these are really pinky. There you go. When I turn it to the side here. Where I block the light. There you go. Okay, so they're gold on the back. And they just slip on. Super cute. Those are very cute. They've got the painted enamel on the front that's glossed over. So 
I'll show you in a minute. I have bought these earrings again with the gold tone hardware so that would be a selection here. And they say 925, so they probably have some silver tone into it. You know, that's usually leading. Shaped like hearts, of course. Of course they're shaped like hearts. Now, if you watched my video where I showed how to get your price adjustments, these earrings were listed in there. <laughs> because they were in one of my orders where I got a price adjustment on. So I said in that video, here's a little glimpse. Oh my goodness. These are adorable. Okay. These are so cute and they're silver tone. I don't know. We're going to get this in here. Like rhinestones or... Who knows? I don't know. You'll see in the in the clip. Yeah, those are super pretty. Very, very cute. They're not too big. They're gonna dangle and be very, very, very happy with those. And they have the rubber backs to them on top of the backing itself. So that's good. I'm out of focus. What am I gonna do, you guys? Okay, I tried to zoom out. Hopefully that'll be better. Man, I hope that I hope this video works out. I just do. Okay, so the rest of the items in here are all of the same category, I think. Maybe we'll have a surprise later on of something I didn't see. Okay, so before we move on to those, this is a car phone holder because I needed one. Now, there's a lot of pieces. It comes like this. It comes in this. It comes just like this in a smashed up box. And if you know Timu, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It's all smashed up. Okay, whatever. I don't care. It's coming out of the box anyway. And then it has this piece. One, two, three pieces here. Here's the two pieces right here. And I'm guessing my phone will go here. And it's all adjustable, so it doesn't just, like, it's not spring. You have to actually unroll that, I think. Nope, maybe not. Good Lord. How do we work this? Okay, well, that just came off. Oh, my goodness. It's, I don't think you were supposed to force it, but I did, and it seems to be okay. I didn't break it. Oh, it's the suction. So that's right. I did. This is a suction one that suctions on, and it gives you this... Um, this pad that you stick to your dash, I guess, and then this would suction onto that pad, and then this can be adjustable, and then this would go like right here. So let's, that's probably why I had to screw, I don't know, you got that in. Oh, and then you would tighten this into whatever position, so it, it, it is adjustable, blah, blah, blah. You put that up on your dash, <laughs> and hopefully it doesn't just, oh, this is tight. Oh, good, thank goodness, because I already saw a problem if that didn't tighten. And then you have the lip down here to also help it hold it into place. Now, I have an iPhone that's sometimes bigger than some of these things allow. Oh, yeah, and you just squeeze it. So it did work. That did work. Okay. Now the real key is lift that up. You would stick this to your dash. Hopefully that doesn't move. Or maybe you don't even need that. And you would just put this down Let's, let me see if I can try it right here while you're watching for this review. I might as well do the review right. Ooh. Oh, yeah. It's going to hold. Okay. So the key. Oh, my God. That is a really sticky pad. So you want to keep this back on there until. So it's a little sticky, but it works by suction. And so once you put it into place, you remove this, put it into place, pop that down. And it's going to stay there. It was pretty tight on the table right now. So, oh, that's awesome. And my phone's usually pretty heavier than most, too. So that is a good... I'm happy with this purchase. Yes. So if you're looking for this device, this might be my most exciting thing. It's not. 
It's not the most exciting thing, but I'm fine with these. So these are little budget. If you have an A6 binder, which I have a couple of them, um, I bought a set for myself and a set for my friend. But really cute little saving. They have all the six holes here for that A6 binder. This one says bills on it. Um, and you can, there's like a whole management system that you can create, or you can go and buy it, pay it for $36 to get a, a one already made up with all the labels. I just thought these were cute. You don't have to pay that much to get these. These were super, super, I think they were like 67 cents or something for each one. And there's one that says spending. That's going to be fat for me. Um, shopping. Oh, another fat envelope. Bills. Oh, I'll probably get that too. Um, food. I don't need to eat. That'll be thin. Thin. Food. So it's just a way to keep track and then some cash. I don't know if you put receipts in here. And I bought two of each. One for, like I said, for myself and one for a friend. Oh, I didn't. This was all in that mix here. So those are nice and they're going to fit in that A6 size. But I think they have different sizes. So it's just. Search them out if you need a different size. However, comma, you will see in the description box below um, my links for these items. Now, I showed you this pair of earrings earlier, but I didn't, I forgot about the white ones too. And they have the rubber backs. These are just so pretty. So pretty, so pretty. And they're gold tone um, hardware with it. Turn that around. I like how big they are too. I like how big those are. Um, okay, I'm trying my best to get those into focus. Just bear with me, you know. I'm trying to, my best to like improve on every video. And I overthink, I overthink a lot and then I end up screwing up like my focus for today, so. Just know my next one will probably be better in some areas and it needs improvement on another area. Okay, so these items, I think they're supposed to, oh, that, I don't know where that is. Okay, so these two items were part of a free gift too. I mean, I got so many free things lately. I don't even know why. This is not a sponsored video. <laughs> I paid for all of this. So now this is a contour three color solution. Okay, funny thing about this is, I've had this in my cart, which is probably why it came up as a free item, several times. Then I got this as a free one, because I chose it. And I forgot to take the other one out of my other cart, so I think I have this twice. I paid for one and I got one for free. And it's this like all-in-one skin correcting toner, um, color you probably have seen it now let's see oh my goodness the struggle is real today so it's got like a purple a pink and this is a dupe off of another brand name so I'm gonna I'm anxious to see how this works Chaffel. the other one says contour they're both boxes are wrapped in plastic so this box this is what this box looked like and that's what that one looked like. Now, I think they're I think they're the same product. Let's we'll see. Oh. They are they they are um but they're packaged a little differently. So here's the other one. And it has more like beads in it and it's actually fuller. So there's that one and there's this one. So one I paid for and one is free, which I don't know which is which at this point doing the video, but I will know when I look. So you can tell they both have the same capacity as far as how full it is, but then the lids are um, more than the other one. So they're both supposed to do skin like evenness and correct the tone of your skin. Kind of like a BB cream is how I'm imagining it. So we'll see, you know, the BB correction moisturizer, foundation, um, creams. Okay. 
Now on to a couple of fun things. Now I kind of, oh, no. Well, this will be funny. So I saw, and I don't know if anybody commented or told her, but I was cracking up watching her demo these. What are these you say? Well, I'll put her link below to that. You know, in when you pack stuff, I'm always wrapping stuff like this um, or creams or lotions in a plastic Ziploc bag and then putting it in my makeup bag or my, um, you know, the luggage separator little bags. But something always leaks. So this is supposed to go on top of the cover. Now she got them for her, her child's uh, bottles, which I thought was brilliant. And you just like, <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble. Okay, so you just, they have different sizes I think here. Yeah, they have different sizes. Let me let me try this with the larger one. These are not, this is not an easy thing to um, demo. So maybe I will stay away from that. But basically, you just slip it on there and it's supposed to keep everything, even if it leaks, it's not gonna come out all over your bag or all over your clothing. And then you just pop it off. Okay, enough said about those. Um, I got them because they had value to me. They were worth it. I've experienced a need for them. But initially, I looked at them because of how hilarious she was in showing me how to use her video. And that's all I'm saying about that. Next. Okay, so now we've got a couple more squishies. And something's going to die on my camera, but I'll be back if it does. Okay, this is crazy, but my whole idea is that these are going to be good purposes. So, and they always come a little smaller than you anticipate. I get that, but dang, they're a lot smaller than I thought. Unless they expand after I open them and then I'll never get them back in that bag. This is a cat. Look how cute he is. He's super cute. He's he's quite a bit of length to him. So Timu probably said he is going to be so many centimeters, which I don't care about centimeters, um, 10 inches. So that's my little kitty. This one is a little piggy. Fluff it all up. Oh, he's so cute. He's so cute. <laughs> so he's he's 10 inches too. This one is a cutie pie. It's a little bunny. Super, super cute. Um, and if we go from the bunny ears down, technically, it's about nine inches. Okay? So there you go. There's that one. And then this is my favorite. It's a koala bear. Isn't he cute? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Squishy galores. Oh, I shouldn't put that white. Squishy galores. Let me see. Can I actually hold them all? What did I do? I'm up to my eyeballs and squishies. But they are, I understand why the kids of all ages love these. They are super cute. Okay. So the fear of missing out got a hold of me again. Oh, scissors. Okay. I know everybody's always looking for their scissors. I'm not, I'm not alone on so that. So I did break down and get a bog bag, or I should say a bog dupe-like bag with some accessories, which I'm gonna break into here in a second. I know you locked, it's pink. I gotta hurry, because I think my camera battery is gonna die. Please don't die on me. I've gone through a lot today just to get this recording done. Oh, and these with the little buttons to put the straps on that do have the B on them already. So I know some don't come like that. The straps are here, and then I would assemble this. And I think this is like the 18 inch one. So you have to look at them. Oh, it's not, it's, it's this is 12 inches. They were saying 14. They must mean 14 up here. Hmm. So anyway, I'm happy with this now. I did a thing that I'm not even sure this is gonna work in here. So I bought a couple of these boards, um, right size bog bag for them, even though I measured, do I have another bag coming? 
I might have a, a larger one coming. I'll have to look at my orders. But these are supposed to be separators that go in here and so that you can attach. Yeah, they're not gonna fit them in this one. I think I, I think I ordered the bigger bag for this to work in. But you would see that as that. So it's not gonna work in the smaller bag. You have to get the larger bag. But what will work are these little attachments. Oh house little trinkets like you don't have any pockets in these bags so it's nice to be able to put um, these buttons and you can wear put it on the inside or the outside of the bag and then I must have ordered in a, another bag because I bought these two one in white and one in pink you the comparison that this name brand lip mask versus the Timu lip mask okay this is the name brand one okay we all know, I mean, I didn't know that name brand before I bought it. And then this is the Timu one. Okay. And Timu one, this came, the name brand one came packaged just like the Timu brand. The only difference is the Timu or the non, the name brand one came with a little slip sleeve and um, applicator in, sorry. And then I've used this, I use this every day and it's more of a, um, Got that pink uh peachy this more peachy look to it on the inside and the outside is a label but when you open the timu brand one and this is called west and mouth lip sleeping mask berry and that's exactly this is called um lip sleeping mask and it's berry flavor too okay so on the timu one it didn't come with a little slip pocket, but it did come with an applicator. And the applicator, I've already used it once because I tried to do this video before. Um, silicone tip, metal, middle section, and plastic on the end. Okay. Now, the bottles themselves look identical. The only difference is the name brand has all their information on the back and the Timu one does not. Okay. And the Timu one is more pinkish in color, so they did change that up a little bit. And this one is more peachy, darker pink. So when you open this up, now I was kind of shocked now, you can see I used some of it, because it's more of a white, uh, pink, almost, I thought it was like a waxy layer on top, but it's not, because I dug into this, and I wanted to see what it's like. Now I love how the other mask works, the name one, which is $24 on Amazon. And I needed it. I needed something drastic like that. So I hate to have to spend that when that runs out. This has more of a berry flavor, more of a berry scent to it. Yeah. It goes on just as smooth as the name brand one. But with all the whiteness to it, I'm putting way too much on. I have to think that there's got to be a little bit of wax. They probably have something in here. It doesn't tell me again I can't see it this writing is so small they don't want you to see it I guess I don't know anyway it goes on it's not like a chapstick wax so it's not thick like that it's very thin and the idea and the way it works when I use it overnight is you wake up with softer lips and it does work on the name brand one. So thank you for watching and if you like this video please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed I invite you to try that now hit the subscribe button and the little bell and you'll be notified when I have a new video go up thank you for watching have a great day